Hi, I'm James Smith and I'm course leader for photography at Norwich University of the Arts. I'm also the chair of the judging panel for the Beyond the Frame photography competition. Beyond the Frame was set up to celebrate the very best of creative photography for those studying at secondary and further education levels. We have some amazing sponsors on board, including Canon Cameras, who have been very kind and given us two cameras to give away as our first prizes for each of our age categories, and Wex Photographic, who have provided the prizes for our Rotary prizes. We also have uh, partners, so the Rotary Club of Norwich are partnering the competition, as well as TES Times Education Supplement. The Beyond the Frame competition takes a great deal of hard work to set up, uh, and it's a dedicated team at Norwich University of the Arts that do that, and I would like to make special mention of Kate Sylvester and Verity Burton, who have been working incredibly hard to put this all together. As you know, we were due to have the awards event at Anyway on the 2nd of April, with talk from our judges, Julia Fulton Batten, Kane Leyland and Faye Doyle. Rather than delaying the event any further, we were thought it would be great to celebrate your achievements now. This year, we've had a phenomenal response, with over 1,500 images and 600 individual entries for the judges to go through. An incredibly hard task. The standard of entries was very high and all of the judges have commented on what hard job it was to select the images for our shortlist. The Judges' Choice Awards. My Judges' Choice goes to a person whose image stood out from the very first time I scrolled through the images. It's one that I came back to time and time again and yes, it took me over a week to go through and select the images. The control of colour and tone allied with the direct gaze of the model holds my attention and portrays a sense of wistfulness. My judge's choice is Hannah Haywood. Well done. I also have the pleasure of announcing the judge's choice for Julia Belgate of Tez. This person's image is beautiful in its simplicity. The horizon splitting the image on the bottom third and the silhouette of the subjects resting upon it. The image feels like a carefree time, people out enjoying morning or evening light. Julia's judge's choice goes to Lydia Goff. On to the winners. The winners was very, very hard fought for both age categories. For the under 16, the images that the judges chose shows a beautiful play of light and shade, as well as consistency that runs through all of the images. The pictures managed to be playful, despite what could easily become overpowering use of black and white. The images would be worthy of winner, irrespective of whichever age group. The winner in the under 16 category is Emily Parsons. The over 16 category. The winner of the over 16 category stood out to the judges from the very start. The use of colour and tone with warm light separating the model from the colder background has produced an, a cinematic image reminiscent of the work of highly regarded photographers such as Gregory Crudson. It gives me great pleasure to announce this year's over 16 winner as Oleg Pantikov. Hi there, this is Julia Um My judge's choice is by Amber Gordon. Congratulations, I think it's a powerful image. It's, um, I love color. It's using color in a very interesting way. It's nearly pop arty. It reminds me a little bit of um, Martin Parr. Uh, it's got a sense of humor. It's, it's good, really good. So well done. Hi, I'm Faye Doyle and my judge's choice is awarded to Ashwini Somasundram. And the reason I chose this entry is because I really feel like with um, landscape photography that capturing the light and capturing the moment at that specific time is really where all the magic happens. And I really felt that this entry had that. So well done. And I can't wait to see more of your work in the coming years. Hey all, I hope you're well. Um, so my Judges' Choice Awards going to the person's image who grabbed me the, from the second I saw it. The connection between the model and the camera just blew me away and in my opinion I think simplicity speaks miles and you kill it. Uh, it's so emotive and connecting so saying all of that, my Judges Choice Award is going to Paige Newell for your black and white portrait. Um, congratulations, I'm a big fan of your work.